Welcome to this week's video tutorial. Today I would like to show you how you can set up drill down reports. This functionality allows you to double click on a polygon in the map to drill down to a report which contains a lower level geography within the area you double clicked. As an example, I created this report with districts of Nottinghamshire. This is my higher level geography report. I also created the lower level geography reports with wards, one for each of the districts. My goal is to be able to double click, for example, the Bassetlaw district in the higher level geography report to open the corresponding wards report for Bassetlaw. However, at the moment, double clicking an area does not do anything. To make the drill down work, I need to first make sure the folder structure of my reports is correct and the folders are named correctly. At the moment, each report is saved in a separate folder. The Districts of Nottinghamshire report is my higher level geography report. The other folders contain the ward reports. Firstly, I need to make sure that all report folders of the lower level geography reports sit inside the report folder of the higher level geography report. So I'm going to move the ward report folders into the District of Nottinghamshire report folder. Now I need to rename the folders of the lower level geography report so that the names match exactly the feature codes of the corresponding districts in my higher level geography report. These are the values of the code field which I selected in the publisher when I created the districts report. To find this code I can open the geographies.csv file in a spreadsheet program such as Microsoft Excel. To make sure that the names of my ward report folder are exactly the same as the codes, I will copy them out of this file and paste them into the folder names. Now the folder structure and names are correct. The second step to make the drill down work is to add a script to the atlas.html file of my higher level geography report. This script can be found in the drill down user guide. The guide can be downloaded from the Instant Atlas website, from the support section under development zone. You will find a link called using geographic drill downs in Instant Atlas. This will open the user guide and this guide will tell you everything I've showed you so far and also contains the essential script which needs to be copied into the atlas.html file of the higher level geography report. This is a script I'm going to copy it into my clipboard. Now I'm going to open the atlas.html file in a text editor and I scroll down until I find the function in it. I highlight this function inclusive the curly brackets and replace it with the content of my clipboard. Now I can save the atlas.html file. And to show you that it will work even without the lower level reports being open, I will close this browser session down completely and I'm going to reopen my atlas.html file fresh for the district's report. If I now double click on one of the geographies, for example the Bassett Law District, a new tab opens with a report that contains ward for the Bassett Law District. If I go back to my district's report and double click on another district, for example the Rushcliffe District, you will see that this time the Rushcliffe wards report will open. 
If you would prefer to have the ward report opening in the same window as the district's report, I can change the script slightly. The user guide will tell me how that works. I need to exchange the line that says window open with location and so on. So I'm going to copy that line out of the user guide, find the window open line in my script and replace it. I save the atlas.html file and refresh the report in my browser. I can now double click on a district and the new report opens in the same tab as before. If you would like to drill up again to your higher level geography report, we recommend that you do this by including a custom button into your lower level geography reports, like I did it here already in this example report. This can be done by opening the config.xml file of this lower level geography report in the designer. A while to load. Now in here you can insert a new button via the main menu insert button and then you have several properties here on the right hand side. The most important one can be found in the links tab, the URL to where the button shall link to and you need to enter in here two dots forward slash and atlas.html. The two dots forward slash basically mean that the report needs to look one level higher in the folder structure than it currently is, which means that it will find the atlas.html file of your higher level report. And indeed, if I click this button now, it opens again my higher level geography report with the districts. If you followed all these steps and the drill down does not work for you, it might be that you need to include the location of your reports into the Flash Player Trusted Locations. Please refer to the video How to Add Your Report Folder to the Trusted Locations of your Flash Player.